T-minus 30 seconds and counting. T-minus 15. T-minus 10. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0, lift off. Miko. <laughs> you can see the light from the engine. <laughs> Light from that first stage engine cutoff. And back ignition confirmed. For main engine cutoff, you saw the successful stage separation, and the second stage engine has started up from those live views on your right there. That Air is separation confirmed. The Merlin vacuum engine, and here we are waiting for fairing separation. You can see that great view of the two fairing halves separating from the Starlink satellites.
stage two FTS is safe. Stage one landing burn has just started. That is our drone ship. Of course I still love you in the Pacific Ocean. of stage one having landed on our drone ship for the 10th time this marks our 90th overall successful recovery of a falcon 9 first stage and the 124th successful launch of a falcon 9. we just missed it but we did have a successful second engine cut off one and a confirmation of a good orbit up next, we will have a coast phase followed by the second burn of our second stage engine. These additional burns allows us to modify the orbits of our payloads more efficiently than launching directly into the final orbit. Starlink deploy confirmed. So that's confirmation of payload deployment. You saw the mechanism separating away and now the Starlink satellites starting to make their way away from the second stage. Shortly they will deploy their solar array. Wow, that's a beautiful shot of uh, Earthrise in the background. Um, but shortly they will deploy their solar array and then over the next few days and weeks they'll start to distance themselves out They've got onboard ion thrusters, and that'll help them make their way into their final operational orbit. <laughs> <laughs> 